हेलो दोस्तों आशा करता हूँ कि आप सब ठीक हो खुश हो वेल हो फाइन हो गुड हो तो फिर हम इस वीडियो लेक्चर में खास करके पढ़ाई करेंगे ठीक है जो कि बेसिक कंसेप्ट ऑफ साइबर सिक्योरिटी क्या क्या है जो कि हम ऑलरेडी पढ़ाई कर चुके थे राइट सो लाइक साइबर किल चेन के बारे में पढ़ाई किए थे डिफरेंट पोर्ट्स के बारे में पढ़ाई किए थे और उसके साथ साथ हम डिफरेंट एग्जाम्पल्स ठीक है उसके अंतर्गत जो जो आता है राइट सो वी हैव डिस्कस्ड एवरीथिंग व्हिच इज रिलेटेड टू फंडामेंटल्स ऑफ साइबर सिक्योरिटी बट इन दिस वीडियो विल बी गोइंग फॉरवर्ड मोर डीपर ड्राइव इनटू द फील्ड ऑफ साइबर सिक्योरिटी एंड व्हाट सॉर्ट ऑफ थिंग्स वी हैव टू लर्न टू ग्रूम आवर सेल्फ ओके व्हाट सॉर्ट ऑफ थिंग्स वी हैव टू टेक ओके सो व्हाट सॉर्ट ऑफ थिंग्स वी हैव टू नो ओके सो दोज ऑल थिंग्स कम्स टुगेदर इनटू रोल व्हेन वी डिस्कस अबाउट द थिंग्स व्हिच आर which which basically comes under uh, email investigation techniques okay तो हम इस वीडियो लेक्चर में खास करके ईमेल इन्वेस्टिगेशन कैसे करते हैं ठीक है उसके साथ साथ डिफरेंट कंसेप्ट्स जैसे कि हमारा हो गया हेडर एनालिसिस ठीक है या फिर नहीं तो हमारा ईमेल थ्रेड्स कैसे आता है डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ ईमेल थ्रेड्स क्या क्या ईमेल टाइप्स ऑफ थ्रेड्स हमको यूजली आता है राइट uh, जैसे कि हम मान सकते हैं फिशिंग आप सब जानते हो फिशिंग सो फिशिंग अटेम्प्ट कैसे होता है तो फिशिंग अटेम्प्ट मतलब डिफरेंट काइंड्स ऑफ फिशिंग अटेम्प्ट जैसे कि हो गया हमारा ओके सो लाइक स्पेयर फिशिंग वी हैव विसलिंग वी हैव मिसिंग एस मिसिंग एंड वी हैव विसिंग ओके सो दोज ऑल थिंग्स कम्स टुगेदर इन टू वन पिक्चर वेन वी डिस्कस अबाउट द कंसेप्ट ऑफ फिशिंग सो फिशिंग वट एक्चुअली फिशिंग इज सो इफ आई गो विद ए डेफिनेशन ऑफ वट फिक्सिंग इज एंड हाउ it works so it is all about uh, sending to some certain organization sending to certain employee or sending to certain person okay with a malicious intent which basically contains uh, you know basically contains very malicious documents attachments images okay so uh, in the form of you are okay you are code phishing you all know that right so those all things comes into role when we uh, when we display uh, the role of uh, phishing in our uh, day to day study in the in the in the in the in the, in the field of cyber security okay so hum uh, basically discuss karenge spear phishing so what actually spear phishing all about so spear phishing is just like a phishing attempt which basically targets organization or infrastructure or employee or an on an individual okay targeting or aiming to gain unauthorized accesses okay to its infrastructure okay so that basically comes under what that basically comes under spear phishing okay so that malicious uh, file or attachment may do certain unnecessary activity or may do some uh, suspicious or uh, unknown activities okay so with their presence right so that is all about spear phishing then after we come to discuss about whistling so what is actually uh, whistling is all about so we is all about uh, targeting the c level employees okay so basically comes under into role when we discuss about whistling okay then after smishing and whistling all about sms uh, targeted uh, individual will be sending through sms okay then after whistling is all about uh, sending the uh, phone calls to get unauthorized accesses okay so that may be you know that may be some unauthorized activity is going to happen or in the form of getting some uh, sensitive data or or we can say um, we can say private data right so individual responsibilities are very uh, crucial in this form in this in this in this scenario right so then uh, it comes with very basic concept of our learning as well about email investigation technique to is video mein hum khas karke email investigation techniques kya hai aur uske sath sath jo bhi hum padhai karenge sock analyst ko kaisa ke kya requirement hai wo sab kuch hum ek sath dekhenge right so email has become one of the most critical communication channel in today's digital world right so enabling the individual and organizations to exchange the information quickly and easily okay तो क्विकली एंड इजीली एक्चुअली मेंटेन करना है क्विकली एंड इजीली एक्सेसिबल होना है तो फिर हम ईमेल का क्या उपयोग करते हैं वी एक्चुअली यूज ईमेल कोलैबोरेशन वी एक्चुअली यूज आवर डिफरेंट डोमाइंस लाइक जीमेल लाइक आउटलुक ओके सो लाइक क्या हू ओके सो दोज ऑल थिंग्स कम्स इन टू रोल वेन वी डिस्कस अबाउट वर्ट अबाउट द ई कम्युनिकेशन 
in this digital world okay so then after however this uh, convention has also made email a prime target for cyber criminals seeking to steal the sensitive information or data to gain unauthorized accesses okay to corporate network in this part of the book you will be exploring the various email based cyber threats okay uh, as a sock analyst uh, may encounter such a phishing or snoofing attack so when we discuss about snoofing right so snoofing basically kya hota hai ki three types of snoofing hota hai ek hai dns snoofing hota hai एक है ईमेल स्मूफिंग होता है ओके okay, और एक होता है क्या कि और एक होता है ए आर पी पॉइजनिंग सो डोमाइन स्नूफिंग और डी एन एस स्नूफिंग डोमाइन नेम सिस्टम स्नूफिंग इज ऑल अबाउट मेकिंग ए लेजिटिमेट एक्शन Uh, जैसे कि आप मान सकते हैं स्नूफिंग इज ऑल अबाउट प्रिटेंडिंग टू बी लेजिटिमेट ओके बट इट इज नॉट लेजिटिमेट बट इट इज सटेन मलिशियस एक्टिविटीज ऑलरेडी हैपन और सटेन मलिशियस रिडायरेक्शन इज ऑलरेडी बीन प्री इंस्टॉल्ड इन दैट ओके सो दैट्स हाउ एक्चुअली द डी एन एस पॉइजनिंग और डी एस एन एस स्नूफिंग बेसिकली वर्क सो द डोमाइन विल ट्रीट यू एज ए लेजिटिमेट साइट ओके इट pretends to be legitimate okay you know then it basically that targets that pretended website will definitely goes into uh, or redirects into unlegitimate sites or malicious sites which basically downloads and installs some uh, illegitimate activities or basically downloads or installs some files in your system to corrupt the or uh, to fetch the information to corrupt the network infrastructure okay so that's all about dns snoofing then after we have email snoofing similarly like we have spf right sender policy see framework we have dkim okay so these are the different frameworks or policies or protocols okay which basically pre installed in the, in the in the email security gateway where it basically protects the things but here email surfing is all about the domains which they are been targeting or the the the, 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 the target host who has been targeted by that email security gateway is not legitimate okay in the very simple sense if i say that domain will treat you as legitimate but that email security or the sender who is sending okay or the recipient who is receiving okay they may have some uh, differentiation between that right so that's all about uh, coming to email security gateway or snoofing kind of attack erp poisoning you all know that right? it is all about address resolution protocol it is just treated as illegitimate or you can say Uh, pretending to be legitimate right so those all things been covered in their phishing and snoofing in the in the form of email investigation techniques okay we also cover the essential skills and techniques that sock analyst must have to have to investigate and analyze email based cyber threat effectively okay the, the this chapter in this part will provide a comprehensive overview of email threat types okay so attacker techniques to evade the email or email security detection like uh, attackers may use social engineering technique to trick a teams the anatomy of uh, security email gateway logs okay or even we can even say uh, email flows email header analysis email authentication and techniques to um, okay or we can say techniques to uh, techniques to investigate suspicious emails okay by the end of this part you will uh, have a knowledge and skill okay you you need to investigate and respond to email based cyber threats effectively right so that is all about uh, in this chapter we will be having email discussion okay so this part uh, following what are the chapter we will be having a discussion one is email in, email uh, investigating email threats then after email flow and header, header analysis okay so these were the two chapter we, in which we will be covering most of the things first is email uh, investigating email threats so email threats are among the most common types of attacks okay encount, encountered by sock analyst and they often okay occur multiple times during your work king shift okay moreover the malicious mails are often uh, often the first at or first steps in the attacker attempts to gain accesses to target network okay given the increase in the steps or you can say given the increase in these uh, types of threats okay so can at least uh, and the cyber investigator must understand the attacker's techniques okay to uh, initiate attacks via email and how to inv- in, uh, investigate and in respond to email threats basically okay So here the objective of this chapter is to learn why attacker prefers phishing okay emails to gain initial access okay the most common email threats the most common technique by attacker to evade the detection and tricks the victims and how to analyze email security gateway logs and how to investigate suspicious emails plays a very crucial role so in this chapter okay in this uh, i can say in this video we will be having a certain main topics okay one is top infection vector followed by why attackers prefer 
uh, phishing okay email to gain initial access okay so then after uh, email threat types okay so then after we also have uh, about uh, the attackers techniques to evade email security detection then after we also will be having a discussion on uh, social engineering techniques or tactics okay tricks the victims basically and the anatomy of securing email gateway logs investigation or investigating and suspicious emails let's get started about all the things which we basically cover in this chapter okay so is may hum sare discuss karenge jo ki top structure vector kya kya hai why attacker basically prefers okay attackers basically kyun phishing emails ko hi target karte hain initial access ke liye to initial access jab aata hai humko एक जरूरी रहना चाहिए एक पॉइंट का जरूरी रहना चाहिए कि वी मस्ट एंड शुड हैव टू नो द साइबर किल चेन तो साइबर किल चेन में पहला होता है रिकॉनसेंस वेयर द इंफॉर्मेशन गैदरिंग और इनिशियल एक्सेस एटेम्प्ट हैज बीन ऑफरिंग उसके बाद रिकॉनसेंस देन आफ्टर वी हैव डिलीवरी सो वंस द रिकॉनसेंस हैपेंड द अटैकर्स ट्राई टू डिलीवर टू द टारगेटेड सिस्टम देन आफ्टर ही स्टार्टेड एक्सप्लोइटिंग द थिंग्स ओके सो देन आफ्टर आफ्टर एक्सप्लोइटिंग द थिंग्स ही स्टार्टेड ही स्टार्ट्स ही बेसिकली स्टार्ट्स इंस्टॉल okay installing whatever the necessary things or necessary files the ee or ca must and should have to happen okay then after we have uh, command and control then action of objective okay so these were the things we must and should have to know when we discuss about the uh, initial access things okay so this is the attack phase attack scenario phase how an attack can happen okay so in the field of uh, cyber security so top infection vector so what are the most common top infection vectors when we discuss so in the chapter on the in the field of cyber attack chain or cyber kill chain once an attacker has concluded reconnaissance jaise ki main bola tha right against the targeted victims environment and infrastructure and prepared the necessary weapons and equipment the next step is to determine the pre preferred methods and techniques to gain uh, initial access okay to the victims network so attacker has several techniques at their uh, disposal to gain initial access okay which basically includes what phishing emails exploiting the public face uh, facing applications okay luring the user to visit compromised website through drive uh, by compromise and stealing the data okay so those uh, were the top infection vector so as per the valid remote credentials such as uh, we have vpn or rdp remote desktop uh, protocols okay so understanding the various techniques attacker used to gain initial access is a crucial form of uh, we can say crucial for security prof professionals to identify and prevent attacks okay before they can cause huge or immense damage okay so that is all about taking a more precautionary step taking a step forward okay so as per ibm security x force report so what are the report basically suggestions about uh, about uh, according to that report what actually happened is that so 41% of the attacker basically prefers phishing attacks or phishing techniques okay to gain the initial access to the victims environment either by sending a weaponized doc comment or a malicious link to the targeted victims okay so here you can uh, see a clear picture right no uh, clear picture of what phishing attempts is all about so phishing attacks attempts are is uh, in 2021 and 2022 according to the data we have this okay so uh, vulnerability exploitation is all stands at uh, 34% okay according to 2021 data so then after uh, stolen credential comes to 9% okay brute force 6% remote desktop connection or rdp connection attempts it stands at 4% okay removal media like pen drives okay password spray okay spraying okay those those all things uh, comes under 1% right so this is uh, the top infection vector uh, from ibm x force threat intelligence index 2022 okay let us explain why the most attack attacker basically prefers that okay to gain initial access by using phishing mechanism right so this is all about why do attacker prefer phishing email to gain initial access that basically comes into our mind that basically sticks into our mind right so attackers kyun basically prefer karte hain email ko ya fir ईमेल को ही एक्चुअली वो बहुत ज्यादा रेफरेंस क्यों देते हैं because a phishing email is a type of social engineering attack okay so again i repeat a phishing email is just a what social engineering attack where an attacker tricks okay target victims into opening a malicious file or even we can say link 
uh, for providing or providing personal or confidential information uh, just like how our password and credit card numbers okay through forwarded emails and uh, here the what happened is that the reason why phishing is preferred and successful way for attackers to gain initial access to the victim's environment is due to several factors okay what are the several factors why phishing attempts becoming one of the bait in the in the field of social engineering attack where uh, where malicious links frauded emails or malicious cont uh, malicious uh, attachments okay comes with and how to do that and what are the reason okay so those all things are the what are the factors okay so those all things will be having a discussion in this so it is easy during the reconnaissance phase to acquire a list of targeted victims user or email address okay so this is uh, basically comes under the reconnaissance phase okay so here what actually happened is that the reconnaissance phase is the first step okay so here again i want to highlight is that highlight uh, the reconnaissance phase of cyber kill chain where the information gathering occurs where the uh, where the fetching of crucial data sensitive data or initial baits or we can even say the initial category uh, initial categorization of uh, you know um, the, the, the 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 data like we can even say our email address usernames or you can say the 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 vulnerabilities of the threats which basically comes okay the weaknesses the weak points okay so those all basically comes in the reconnaissance phase of cyber kill chain okay so here uh, what actually happened is that the reconnaissance phase is the first step okay basically uh, you know taken by the in, uh, inducer okay to breach a targeted system or the network okay so this phase uh, can last for hours or even we can say days or weeks or even 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 months okay so during this phase what actually happened is that the attacker collects the information about the target victim okay so basically what it happened is that the attacker starts collecting that uh, victims uh, victims information okay so like just like including the email addresses you can say so uh, which can be used to deliver weaponized documents or even we can even say links okay so attackers can collect email addresses in several ways okay uh, such as through job posting social media platforms or just like uh, linkedin third party subscription okay even uh, when say data leaks on the dark web okay way back a mission achieve such an uh, achieve.org or data collection from marketing platform uh, just like our zoom.info or zoominfo.com okay it is not harder to prepare weaponized attachment or links okay so basically when we when a certain targeted host is been targeted by a threat actor okay then it is not even difficult okay it is not even hard to draft an email which basically contains malicious attachment okay weaponized attachments or even we can say specific set of links okay so that's plays a very crucial role folks why because here what actually happened is that it is relatively easy for attacker to upload malware okay to to legitimate cloud platform okay so a malware can be uh, deployed a malware can be installed a malware can be you can you know a malware can be uh, easily uh, uploaded to the cloud platform okay so then share the download link okay with the victims through email such that the cloud platform is we basically treat as cloud platform is one of the best platform where we are much safer right so sas okay software as a service okay so that's basically comes why okay that basically comes into our mind why the weaponized document through visual basic of application okay macro or sense the malware executable itself in a compressed format of uh, okay so all of which it sends to victims via email okay so this is how actually it is basically doesn't been much harder so for example if i starts uh, you know uh, if i if i if i up starts uploading a certain uh, document or certain software or certain malware or can say uh, which basically have some installed pre-built uh, you know uh, pre-built malicious content okay to uh, drive google drive so then after uh, i basically what i ha actually have done that uh, basically from that uh, google drive i have copied that link okay so i have uh, made that visibility to everyone okay so here what actually comes into role that cia trait okay so when a three actor do not even looks after the cia trait organization here looks after cia trait because the confidentiality 
ओके अवेलेबिलिटी एंड सी आई कॉन्फिडेंटलिटी अवेलेबिलिटी एंड इंटीग्रिटी ओके सो दीज थ्री बेसिक बेसिक क्राइटेरिया डजन फॉलोड बाई एनी थ्री ट्रैक्टर राइट सो दट्स दट्स हाउ एक्चुअली द अवेलेबिलिटी बीन टू एवरी वन राइट वंस द वंस द मलिशियस लिंक्स और वंस द मलिशियस कंटेंट हैज बीन सेड टू द टारगेटेड विटम डेफिनेटली ही और सी मे 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 गेट सम डिसएडवांटेज राइट फॉर इंस्टॉलिंग सर्टन थिंग्स ओके सो मेनी यूजर लैक सिक्योरिटी अवेयरनेस वाई बिकॉज द अटैकर एक्सप्लोर द फैक्ट ओके दैट मेनी यूजर ओके मे बी वोल्यूनरेबल टू सोशल इंजीनियरिंग टैक्टिक्स एंड द मेजोरिटी ऑफ दैम मे नॉट हैव रिसीव प्रॉपर सिक्योरिटी अवेयरनेस जस्ट लाइक हाउ द ट्रेनिंग टू रिकोगनाइज एंड response to threat okay so that basically comes under role okay so now that you uh, now that you basically understand why most of the attacker choose phishing email as a way to achieve their goals okay such as uh, we can say initial access to victims environment okay so let us discuss about various types of uh, threats which i have uh, given a clear image okay me actually aapko ek uh, clear image uh, bata diya hu pehle hi ki what sort of things or what are the different types of email uh, or or you can see phishing attempt basically comes but here we will be having email threat types so basically you know when we discuss about uh, email type threats so email threats are very uh, you can say every threats in your environment faces uh, when fa- faces when uh, deciding the to use such uh, or to use an email uh, services okay they are not limited to phishing email only some attacker also use email for blackmailing okay even we can say information leakage data exfiltration or even we even we can uh, say about uh, say all about uh, lateral movement so you know in this session we'll uh, we'll focus on email threat that basically originate from external source and discuss uh, in details for uh, common types of email threats okay uh, that basically organization basically face okay that is about spear phishing attachment or fear spear phishing attachment spear phishing links blackmailing email or business email compromise okay so these are different social engineering attacks also i can say and we'll be having a detailed understanding about that as well okay so let us discuss about a spear phishing attachment so what actually a spear phishing attachment and how we can remediate the things and how we can analyze the things how we can have a clear idea on uh, spear phishing attachments so when we discuss about a spear phishing attachment right you know folks the it basically involves adversaries sending phishing emails okay to a target or you can say the the, the three tactor okay start sending phishing emails to targeted victims with malicious attachments okay either to gain initial access to their system or to harvest the credentials okay credential harvesting one of the ba- basic of uh, in identity based thefts or identity based attacks okay so that is all about credential harvesting okay so credential stuffing okay so here what actually happen is that with the form of the wealth of spear phishing the attackers may uh, gather the crucial information okay or malicious attachments or malicious links okay or by harvesting their credential okay so after defining okay after defining a list of victims email addresses and preparing the weaponized attachments what actually happen is here is that the attacker become ready to send the email okay so when the attacker starts sending the email to the victims with one such link or one just click okay however the question remains here is clear why because which weaponized attachment will be uh, will have will an attacker basically choose okay let us discuss the most common weaponized uh, attachment uh, okay types uh, okay used by the three attacker what are the different sort of uh, weaponized attachments so note here we have to note is that so phishing and spear phishing are both different types okay phishing and spear phishing are both types of email attacks okay that basically aims of stealing information okay or compromise a targeted computer system okay and here what actually happened uh, in the similar uh, situation and the similar intention is all about uh, gaining initial access okay and the ultimate goal and the prime difference between the two okay is the level of targeted involved okay or targeting individual involved so phishing email or mass email attacks that are uh, okay so that is all about uh, camping 
okay that we have to understand okay fishing camping that we say right at a time they basically sends to numerous uh, members who are under the target list okay so they are just making a trial and hit methods he if he doesn't someone else if someone doesn't someone or else so that basically comes under what that basically comes under the uh, targeted of uh, you know uh, targeted of, of fishing attacks right or we can even say targeted of individual or a group we can say when we discuss about spear fishing are much more targeted for a certain person or certain individual okay they specially carpet uh, crafted to target particular individual or a group of individual such as employees okay so or we can say a particular company or member of a specific organization right so that basically uh, comes under what spear fishing attachment so spear fishing types what are the different sort of spear fishing types so uh, spear fishing types when you hear the term spear fishing attachment right so you may think about uh, just one or two types of attachment okay but uh, due to the different preferred attacker methods okay so what actually happened is that uh, preferred methods infrastructure and businesses and attack goals okay there are variants of uh, malicious attachments okay types that attackers email to targeted victims okay the following are the five most common example of uh, you know spear phishing uh, attachments or spear attachment types okay the here what actually happened is that uh, the malicious microsoft office document okay attacker often uses a weaponized okay you know a weaponized microsoft document via with a v a micros okay such as excel or even we can say words or powerpoint documents and send it to the specific set of targeted victims okay to trick them into opening it okay here okay hereby uh, gaining initial access to the to their to their missions okay so this type of attachment is the most commonly used in spear phishing at attacks okay so why because uh, most almost all the enterprises uses the microsoft document in their everyday uh, work right so so additionally it is easier for attackers to develop okay the weaknesses okay develop the microsoft document and uh, weaponize the microsoft document provided ultimate features to attacker and also they can exploit known vulnerabilities that basically affects the office uh, office apps okay so that uh, basically comes in malicious microsoft document or okay microsoft office document spear phishing types i am discussing about spear phishing attachment types so one is malicious microsoft office document okay with vba we have already discussed visual basic uh, visual basic applications right macros okay just like powerpoint excel all the things okay then after malicious pdf files pdf files are most vulnerable folks why because attackers can also use to deploy pdf files that basically contains malicious code okay to explore the pdf reader vulnerability and uh, also gain initial access to the victim system and to harvest their credential okay so here what actually happened is that the pdf files are most popular choice for the attackers because it allows okay them to easily embed malicious javascripts and codes and uh, intrusion of links images and fronts and to make a file appear legitimate and increase the likelihood that the victims will interact with okay so that's basically comes under role right let's just like example at the rate so here what actually you think that it is a legitimate site from microsoft but you haven't looked after the url which has been okay which has been uncompressed which has been uh, illustrated which has been uh, displayed or which has been uh, in the in the in the limelight right so that's basically you haven't Observe if you haven't observed or if you fail to observe the things, then definitely will become a one of the highest bait for this kind of attacks. Okay, so I will not be taking much of your time, folks. So this is how actually I lure the things, or this is how actually I explain the things. So if you uh, feel free to comment. in the session so we have discussed about certain topics okay so we have discussed covered about top infection vectors we have also discussed about why attackers basically prefer email to gain initial access we have also discussed email types and threats okay so uh, in the upcoming uh, videos we'll be having attackers technique to evade email security detection and followed by these three okay so this is all about today's video analysis and thanks thanks for your time folks